Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Coliseum. In the last part, we just got to near the end of the Mirror B fight right here, and we are just now trying to finish it up. So, Espeon is really low in health. I don't really... Here, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to... Crap. Revives? Ah, here's... Uh... Dang it. Here, let's just go ahead and heal. I need health. <laughs> Seriously. Alright, so let's put that up and fight Reflect. Let's just take off some damage here. Or at least just prepare. Because either one of us could go down pretty easily now. Oh, great. Rain Dance. How long does Taunt even last in this game? It doesn't even say when it wears off. Okay, good. Perfect. That's awesome. Alright, now I really need to kill that Ludicolo. Seriously. Alright, Rain Dish. Blah, blah, blah. Gosh. Okay, Bite. Ludicolo. Fusion, Ludicolo. I've got to kill that thing, because this thing is going to drive me up the wall. Alright. As long as... They, I mean, I'm just glad they don't have too, too much defense. It's all in the HP. Really. It's all it is. Okay, good. Just one more turn, and he'll be dead. Dang it. Good. Baited the attack. Ah, low kick. Ooh. I have no words. I have no words to describe the stupidity of the AI in this game. Seriously. What is going on? An admin. They should have better AI. I mean, you know? They shouldn't... Oh, whatever. Anyway. Alright. Ludicolo is going down in this effing turn. Like, right now. So, down it goes. No! No more dancing sombrero-wearing frogmen. No! Anyway. Um... Experience. Ooh, Umbreon's about to level up. Alright, Shadow Rush. Now comes the moment of truth. Now we just gotta catch this dumb thing. Alright, now let's get, uh... Let's keep Umbreon out there, but let's, um... Get somebody else. Ah, no, no, no. Who should I get out there? Uh, fight, uh, taunt. Just do nothing. Um... Actually, no, here, let's bite him. Alright, fight, bite. And then Pokemon. Now let's get Flaffy out here. Let's take a lot of its speed off, just for the heck of it. I mean, it's not like I can do anything else. I'm, I'm not allowed to kill it, you know? Okay. So now let's start. Alright, bite. Come on, don't... Good. Okay, now I'm going to try to start catching it. Because this is when I need to start. Grab Shadow Rush. Okay, ow! Oh, jeez! Jerk! I'm just glad the Shadow Rush isn't, like, a uh, takedown, because, you know, no matter how much damage you do with Shadow Rush, it always seems to do the same amount of damage with the recoil. Um, here, let's get Meditite. No, 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 uh, let's get Slugma out there. I'm gonna use Slugma as death fodder, so that, uh, hopefully he'll use a Rock-type move instead of Shadow Rush, and then I can continue to just try to catch it. Man, Slugma, must suck to be out in the rain, you know? I mean, since you are sentient lava... Alright, anyway, Ultra Ball, items, swap them, right? And then, I have Yawn, I can use that. Uh, yawn. Go. Okay, let's do this. Please catch it. I do not want to come this far and have to do a whole other take of this just to catch this dumb thing. Alright, one. Dang! Dang, man, that's not good. <laughs> Alright, anyway, let's try this again. Oh, good. Paralyzed and it can't move. That's awesome. That's exactly what I'm looking for here. It's just the paralysis hacks. Okay, good. The rain stopped. That'll make the turns go a lot slower, too. I mean, um, they'll go a lot faster since we then we don't have to watch the rain fall. Alright, and then... Come on. We all know. Right, and then, uh, yawn once again. Only got ten turns of yawn available, but I don't think... This is going to take 10 turns. I really hope it doesn't take 10 turns. Good gosh. Otherwise, we're going to have another Furret or Quillfish on our hands here. One, two, three. Awesome. Perfect. Awesome. All right. There goes Mirror B, the coolest man ever introduced in a Pokemon game, with the possible exception of the Gold and Silver rival. Anyway, there he goes. Awesome. How, how, how dare you? Don't you dare think you'll get away with your latest outrage. One of these days, I will take great pleasure in kicking you about with my elegant dance steps. Oh, and I'm not giving up our Shadow Pokemon plan. Let's go, escape. I love it how they're, watch this, they're dancing on the way out. That's freaking awesome. But then again, that also does 
show quite a bit of laziness that the developers wouldn't even edit their sprites to, you know, move. Alright, anyway, right behind you, you get this item. We get TM-49. Uh, I don't remember what it is. I'm pretty sure it's not Rain Dance, though, in case you were wondering. Ah, Snatch. Okay. Alright, here, go ahead and talk to this book. We get an Iron File. We get the Iron File P. What is this? Purification. Shadow Pokemon are fighting machines created by closing the doors of their hearts. The process of restoring a Shadow Pokemon back to its original state is known as purification. Exactly how a Shadow Pokemon is purified is unclear, but there appear to be several causes. We must eliminate reaction to these factors and create Shadow Pokemon that will never revert back to the original purified forms. Shadow Pokemon Lab Chief Ein. Alright, here we go. Get this item here. We get the Macho Brace. Uh, the only reason I would ever see that as a useful item is just in a Trick Room team. And Trick Room didn't exist in this game, so it's not really that good. Basically, it just increases your attack power while lowering your speed at the same time. So anyway, Duking comes in here with Silva. And, uh, I was about to call it Pichu. Uh, Plusle's jumping up and down. Alright, blah blah blah. Yes, we drew him. We drove him out. Blah, blah, blah. Let's get out of here. All right, Boo, we owe you a great deal. Sincerely, thank you. If you were even a bit later, a Plusle could have been made a Shadow Pokemon. That's horrible. Glad everything's fine. And Plusle, too. Yay, we're celebrating because we saved a random mouse. And then, after you beat Mirror B and do this whole cutscene, Plusle will join you. Plusle will join you. And it will join to level 13. It's not really what I'd consider a very good Pokemon. At least not by the standards of, like, oh, I don't know, Raikou. That you can, you know, you can get Raikou in this game. So I usually just hold off on an electric type until you can get Raikou. So, yeah. I mean, you can use it. I mean, since you did get it from another person, it has, you know, the boosted experience. Just like another traded Pokemon. Now, one thing I'm going to do, I, uh... Those items in the cave. I forgot to get them. Ollie, we'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Anyway, um, what I was saying before, I forgot the items that were in here, in this cave, and they are right over here. These are the items that I missed here. Let's get them. Alright, first we get a Carbo, so it increases your Pokemon speed. Although I don't really know why I'm telling you this, since probably all of you already know that. And then Zinc, same thing, but for special defense. Protein is uh, physical attack, and then iron is physical defense. Alright, well, I know that we're not really even at the time limit now, but I'm going to go ahead and end it off here. Um, actually, I'm just going to I'm gonna show you the staircase that we were at. See, it's this one right over here. It's the staircase to uh, the right of where the Swab Blue guy is. So, just fight the guy with the Swab Blue, and then take both paths down there with the staircase. Right here. Um, so yeah, that's about it. We beat Mirror B, and we got his Sudowoodo on the first shot, so I think that's pretty good. So I'll see you in the next part. Bye.